Hey guys, it's Lauren and today I'm going to be doing an indie bath haul. Now today's haul is from Bath Make Love. Um, I had to refilm this video because my phone packed up a few days ago and I had the video and then I realised there was no audio on all the videos that I had filmed, um, which were two videos, so I had to refilm the video. So I have actually used a few of these products already because um, I have everything saved to Google Photos but I was not expecting the audio to not work. So a few of these items have already been used. One of the items I've actually already done a demo of. So I'm just going to show you the items and let's just get into the products. So. I ordered three items from the Harry Potter restock and then Sarah Meg actually sent over five items for me which is really really sweet of her to do so thank you so much. Um, I don't know if you remember ages ago when my Harry Potter gift set never turned up and she gave me the money back for the Harry Potter gift set and to spend it towards something else in the shop and I used that already um, but they weren't the exact same items so she actually sent me five products from the Harry Potter collection which she didn't have to do because she already refunded me so it was really really sweet of her to do that and I can't wait to show you what I got so I'm gonna show you the items that I bought first um, all of the items that I bought was 6 95 I don't know how much everything else is so I'm not going to mention price too much, but I do want to say a huge thank you to Sarah Meg. So, the first item that I picked up was the Night Bus Bath Oil, or Bath and Body Oil. This is a beautiful scent. It's a beautiful rose and something else. Definitely rose. It has like a rose and mossy kind of scent to me and it is a beautiful see all the shimmer in there I think the bath oils are so moisturizing and my grandma really liked the scent of this as well my granddad wanted to steal it too he was like I'm gonna use all your stuff in the bath because he has baths as well so it's a beautiful shimmery color I love their bath oils a lot um, the next item I picked up was Van Doffy Tart Fluffy Whip Soap. I don't know how this has relevance to Harry Potter, I don't know the reference. I get everything else, but I'm not sure about Van Doffy. Maybe it's a sweet or something. So I have actually started using this item already. It's a really, really nice banana scent, and you've got a part of a body scrub there at the bottom it's like a banana toffee and sugary kind of scent I really love it and I'm very glad I picked that up because it smells amazing and is it me or did the lids change colour I feel like they change colour I can't tell because I don't have the rest of my collection with me but I think the lids have changed colour I don't know and then I picked up a mandrake cake and then Sarah Meg put another one in. So I've used this one already. Um, I started using it already <laughs> because it smells amazing. So I'll show you this one. So I bought one and then Sarah Meg put one in for me. And they have these cute little leaves in there. And this is based off the little mandrake um, plant things the plant thingies, I can't remember what movie it was in, number three maybe, I don't know, but you've got like little sugary bits to look like soil, how would I describe this, it's like chocolate and mint, definitely, it says on the sticker actually, it's mint and chocolate with something else, like mint chocolate and sugar. I think using sugar in products like brown sugar or coconut sugar really gives the product a scent. So I'm very happy I got those and already started using, really like it. 
She did put in a Butterbeer fizz gel, which I've already done a demo of. I'll leave a link to that if you want to go see that. Um, the scent of this, oh my god. It reminds me of some of the Christmas items that came out um, at Christmas, obviously. It smells similar or the same as Maple Nog Scrub and the Gold Nog Bubble Syrup. I love the scent of this. Really, really nice scent. And it was my first experience using a fizz gel as well. I think they're, they're interesting. <laughs> okay, next we have, we have three more products. This is the other item that not just me, but my family have used. It's the Polyjuice um, Bubble Syrup. You can use it as a shower gel and a hand wash if you don't have a bath to use it as bubble bath. Um, so thank you for the little pump soap. I was actually going to pick one of these up in my next order because I was like, I could use these as hand wash. Um, but my family, when they sniffed it, they were like, they tried to nick it from me. Um, I was uh, like unboxing the parcels on the bed with them and then they were just like crowding round and they wanted to sniff everything as well. Um, and they really like the scent of this oh, and it's I think it's very similar to the emerald elixir that came out for the Wizard of Oz it's lime and frankincense it says it's very nice I really like the scent of that and the colours are I just dropped it the colours are absolutely stunning I'm so clumsy and can you see that nearly half has gone already? It's probably been in the bathroom about a week now. Um, they love it. When I had all the items out on the bed, my grandma hid it underneath the cover and she thought I wouldn't notice it was gone. And I did because I was like, it's green, it's bright green, you can't not miss it. They like, they like this company too now. <laughs> So very happy, my family are very happy that they get to use it. They really like the scent of that, even my granddad. And then the next product is Dementor's Kiss. I am so thankful that this is in here because um, the first time I missed it, I missed out on it, it sold out. Second time, it sold out. The bath oil was sold out like within minutes mental they look so cool um and this is like a black color and i'm very excited for a black bubble bath because the only black bubble bar that i know of is the bewitched one that lush do for halloween and that's it like i need another black bubble bath or bubble bar in my life because i like the color black but the scent of this is violet and a very, very subtle scent of cocoa. It's very prominently violet and I like the scent of that. So thank you for putting this in. I cannot believe it sold out twice. <laughs> like that, that is mental to me. And then the last item in here is the um, draft of Peace Bubble Bath and it is um, it's described as lavender mint and the colour there's an insane amount of shimmer in this one as well really really pretty oh, I love the scent of that it's like very very sweet it's like a sweet mint scent and then a little bit of like lavender oh, it's so calming I love the scent and I love the colour I love literally anything lavender so thank you so much for putting this in I cannot wait to use it um really love this this was had like the most amazing scent to it I wanted to eat it um, I've actually been to Harry Potter Studios um in London where they show how you, they make like behind the scenes and stuff 
I went with my mum and my grandma and we went and had butterbeer and oh my god it tastes amazing and I um, you had to pay extra if you wanted to keep the cup and we were like we're gonna keep the cup and we did that the cup I still have the cup from like two years ago or three years ago whatever it was and I wish there was like a recipe for how to make butterbeer it probably is but it's like a butterscotch kind of scent best best scent ever I swear and then I'm very excited to use this beautiful bath oil because sometimes my skin is dry but then the skin on my face is mega oily like I have had a crazy like can you see that <laughs> oh my face is just so spotty at the moment crazy um but I think that is it for this video I think the item that smells the best my family thinks this smells the best I oh, I might have to say the bandoffi actually and this was really good as well Every week smells so good. I actually have another order coming in, two orders, um, from Bath Make Love, from the Disney villain slash heroes range. I bought more of the villain side because that's what I'm into. So thank you guys so much for watching and again thank you to Sarah Meg for sending me these things. Um, they're definitely going to get good use out of them. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video.